right, so we've had a request to talk a little bit about fan fiction because it came up and we like, all we all were we, we, very we, we all, into it. We yeah, were all, all fans of fan fiction written. and fan Dungeons fiction and Dragons in and of itself yeah. is yeah. a fan fiction in reality. Yeah. It's like turning yeah. something that already exists and just making up your own story yeah. about it involving the characters. Absolutely. Or, or sometimes even adding your own characters into it and stuff such as yeah. like Oh, or absolutely. adding new things into it or exactly. making alternate universes where they Those all work the at best. a coffee shop or they're all dragons or they're all wizards or they all go to college or whatever. Or crossovers. Crossovers. Right. crossovers. Yes, baristas. So a crossover, for anyone who may not know, a crossover is essentially when you take two different fiction pieces, such as, let's go, Harry Potter and My Hero Academia. Yeah. And you, what you do is you sit there and you actually mesh those two ideas together in order to take the characters from here and take the characters from here and say, you all go to the same school now. Yeah, they all meet, or there's ones where they just take characters from one thing and then transpose them into something else. For example, like, is in the setting. My Hero Academia, yeah. Harry Potter, is if you take all these little guys and turn them into wizards instead of superheroes. Yeah, or, wizards, or you yeah. take... I don't know, Final Fantasy characters, and suddenly they're all in the Hunger Games setting, or they all go to Hogwarts, <laughs> and they don't do anything that happens in Final Fantasy. I haven't yeah. played Final Fantasy in ages. Or they do ages. have things that happen in Final Fantasy, but they've somehow translated it into whatever oh, yeah. the hell J.K. Rowling has been doing. And oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, whatever J.K. Rowling has written or not written and is just included on her Twitter. Bouncing off right. of what Patricia said, it's like... Final Fantasy, it's like, well, they're in Kingdom Hearts, you know, that's a crossover right there. That's there you go. It's the whole game's Kingdom, crossover. Kingdom Hearts, Kingdom Hearts is, is the biggest is... crossover well, exactly. ever, and yeah. it's making money. Yeah, yeah you can have Be Mickey Mouse and Cloud Strife talking to each other on the same Speaking plane. Speaking of Cloud right. Strife. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> Which, by the way, is a real trip when you're basically watching a Kingdom Hearts cutscene that's pretty much just um, the movie Tangle, but Goofy is standing in the background. <laughs> Which, by the way, happens in Kingdom Hearts 3. I have seen clips. I haven't gotten that far yet, oh, to be yeah. quite honest. She's I've rolling down gotten... a hill, wrapped in her own hair, and there's Goofy in the Kingdom Hearts outfit, nice. just standing there yeah. in the background, in the grass. I don't, I've only gotten to the Hercules section of Kingdom Hearts 3, so... There you go. Kind of yeah. I only ever played. Oh, God. Number one, probably. 358. And a half days. Uh, Did I get two? it right? Yeah, I, over two. That I try every time. The title should not be a fraction, but that's beside <laughs> the point. <laughs> fan fiction. Please fan fiction right. to the so, absolute minimum. We're gay and don't remember. <laughs> yeah. right. So, so, so fan, fiction, so, yeah, fan fiction. So yeah, fan fiction. Fan fiction is essentially something that people are making money off of now. Yeah. To be quite honest, it's really weird. So, yeah. uh, if anyone remembers the Fifty Shades of Grey franchise, yeah. I don't recommend most people read it because no, it's, it's not incredibly good. weird. It's, it's weird it's and just bad. bad. So but, just bad. But, fun, but fun fact is, but fun fan fact fiction. Is, it was yeah. based off of originally a Twilight fan fiction. Oh, oh yeah. Yep. There's even recently, I don't know how recently, but there was a, um, a Harry Styles fan fiction that got turned into a movie. They, they changed all the names, but I think it was called After? Yeah. I don't know if it was a book before they made it into a movie, but it was, it was made on, into a uh, movie. Wattpad? Wattpad. Oh, Wattpad. Wattpad, yeah. yeah. By yeah. the way, <laughs> places you can find fan fiction. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. There's Anywhere. Fan... Anywhere. Everywhere. I have read fan fiction on but Facebook. But the most, popu but the most popular read, sites would be fanfiction.net yeah. uh, for, for more upgraded it's... adult people, uh, there's adultfanfiction.net, but they're also like... There's Wattpad. Archive of Our Own. Yeah. I there's say Dream that Wit. There's, um, there's old live, live journal communities. There's old archives from like the 90s if you want to, if you like using the Wayback Machine and you don't <laughs> mind digging a little. Right. And yeah. Yeah. why, why is that so deeply ingrained in the internet? Yeah. People would get sued. <laughs> The lot, reason a lot of the stuff is missing now or gone or has you have to hunt it down on archive sites is people used to get sued for it. Like one of the